Hello, my name is Vasti Verma with the Avaya Serviceability Engineering team. This video is about how to configure SSH in Wireless LAN 8100 controller using Enterprise Device Manager or EDM. Login into the wireless controller using the Enterprise Device Manager. From the configuration menu, click on Edit. And then from sub menu, click on security. Here, click on the security. Once clicked, it will show multiple tabs under the security menu. We will be configuring SSH, hence, click on the SSH tab. Once clicked, it will show the SSH configuration menu. Here, we see that Port is default, which is 22, and timeout is 60 seconds for the SSH session, which can be changed. And the key action is generate DSA, which will generate the security key. In the next section, under TFTP server IP net address, we can specify the TFTP server address and TFTP file name where we can download the SSH public key. In the next section, we can provide the SSH auth key a file name and the USB target unit. For enabling the SSH, select the radio button True and click on Apply. This will enable the SSH on this wireless controller. Click on Refresh. Now let's try an SSH session on this controller. Open the putty and select the SSH option from here and click on open. This will open a SSH window for that controller. Now to verify, click on the adjacent tab which is SSH session. If you see here, there is an SSH session established from my computer to this wireless controller. To disable the SSH, go back to the SSH menu and select false and click apply once applied this will disable the ssh on this controller thank you for your time today we welcome comments questions and feedback at mentor at avaya.com or on twitter at avaya mentor for more details or related information please visit support.avaya.com thank you for choosing avaya